What's going on, guys? It's Mitch from Candidate at the Movies introducing Larice. Hi, guys. And today we're actually going to be reviewing the Apple TV series, The Last Days of Ptolemy Gray. The Last Days of Ptolemy Gray is a six episode mini series with starring Samuel L. Jackson, Dominique Fishback, Omar Benson Miller, and another. And few other ensemble cast members. Um, the story is about an old man who has kind of become withdrawn. Um, he's dealing with dementia mm -hmm. and he's living in his home um, where his nephew played by Omar Benson Miller comes and he's the only person who comes and checks on his uncle, takes care of his uncle. His uncle is what I mean a hoarder he is stuck in his house to where his he hasn't taken care of his house he actually uses the bathroom and old bean cans and pours it down the sink um all he eats is beans and his nephew is the only one who comes down sometimes and takes him out handles his business feeds him and you know he'll come maybe once a week or whenever he can make it to him. and he actually um, keep up with the days by how many bean cans he's eaten. So that's when he knows his nephew is coming back, when he gets down to a certain amount of cans. Mm -hmm. And the, the, the issue is that his nephew actually goes missing or something happens to his nephew to where nobody comes and shows up for, for, for Ptolemy. Um, and you see for his going through this process of his caretaker, his only person he know, he known to come take care of him, um, that he can remember without, you know, freaking out or losing his mind and going through that process and taking care of his last days of, you know, him living or going, his mind being together. And even though he has dementia, like he recognizes that his nephew has not come. And so he's like asking himself, like, where is he? Where is he? But because he's not, like, out in the community and things like that, he doesn't really go outside unless he's with his nephew. He doesn't, you know, he's not going out to try to find him or anything like that. He's just wondering where he is. Exactly. So, for me, to me, this mo this series was awesome. It was great. Um, Samuel played his role to a T. I mean... Some some kind of award should be given because he was awesome in it. Dominique Fishback was probably my favorite character of the show. Um, she she's been good in everything she's been in lately, so I expect her to get more roles and and get more opportunities. Every time I see her, she does great. Um, just overall overall good story. It wasn't too long. I like the the six episode miniseries, you know, it, it gave me a story. It didn't drag me too long. It was never an episode that I was like, they didn't have to do this episode or it didn't feel like a filler episode. Every episode I was like, oh man, oh man, I, I can't wait for the next episode. Oh, it's only mm -hmm. six episodes. We're almost done already. So I thought it was, I thought it was a definitely a, a great episode. What did you think, Larissa? I thought it was great. Six. Um, I thought it was great for a miniseries. Uh, like you said, it didn't uh, have any filler episodes. Um, all of the episodes were good. Um, all of them told a story. Uh, the ending, you know, left it at, you know, it's okay if that's the end of it. Um, but if they wanted to, like, branch off and tell you about other people or, you know, um, do something else with Ptolemy Gray, then it... it it left it open for that as well, but it gave you enough to be satisfied yes. at the end. So I loved it. Exactly. Exactly. So what what would you give it as an overall letter grade? Um, I would give it an A. I like it. Um, I like Samuel Jackson. Um, I'd never heard of uh the the female before. Dominique. Dominique. Um, I'd never heard of her before, but she did a great job. Um, her character was very believable. Um, it wouldn't surprise me if they did a spinoff uh, with something about her, a little mini series, uh, because she definitely has a story. So I, I thought it was good. And, and, I, and I agree with you. A was going to be my my score. Um, high A. I, I wanted more. That's like an A plus. 
I didn't want to give it quite an A+. Plus. Really? Yeah, but it was definitely, you know, 98. <laughs> right there at it. But, you know, um, overall, just a, just a great series. Something that you could watch. It didn't take up too much of your time. Mm -hmm. um, you will not be disappointed in it. I highly recommend you watch this series if you have Apple TV. If you don't, find somebody who does so that you can watch it. Um yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Go see this show. Um, Ptolemy is spelled with a P.